Sometimes I do feel the little in something gives you the loss in everything. The little droplets of rain merge into a large ocean. The little fingers when you grasp steps into a larger piece of strength. Sometimes the little pain you bear gains you with savory fruits, and the little smile you cherish. the larger the colorful life you sour so in between those little last notion we are in the midst of our destination again The rhythmic beats of the traditional moving shuttle glorify the essence of Salkusi town. Situated on the northern bank of mighty Brahmaputra, the region is engulfed with its hard-working educated common masses, trade and business, and most importantly for its waving culture. Commencing from the morning till the dark, the shuttle looms flow on an uninterrupted pace. The weavers work all day long and are engaged in manufacturing various forms of traditional wares. Some households are engaged in this craft for their own use, but most of the families marketize this form of craft. Girls at young age as well as married women come to this region to earn their livelihood. कई बस हल यार पचिश बस अपनी यार की की बना याते अपना लोगे बोल ये मेखला मेखला साधा मेखला हाँ साधा ना कौन मेखला नौकल में अच्छा नौकल मेखला है तो हर अपना लोग किमान के बाये ने इन्हें बिके में तेरा खो तेरा खो हाँ की कहे मेखला बना तो किमान टाइम लगे कंप्लीट होटे दूसरी दिन दूसरी दिन दूसरी दिन हो जाए रो ना अपना जो अपना वो डिजाइन बनवा दिया है रो ना कार्ड तो 
ये कार्ड बोल दिया से अपना लोगों माले के ना ये सब अपना बना बोला के बोली बोला के अच्छा ना आपको तो हाथेरी का तीसरा आज मैं इधर आ जाऊँगी ना ओह ओह the colored silk threads are initials for the letter produce various sets of colorful wares some weavers originate from salkosi itself while many come from outside and settle in this region being involved in the business they are earning their own before the weaving starts the designs of the dresses are imprinted on some curd plates and accordingly the dresses are made as far as historical evidence is concerned, it is said that a weaving tradition in this region began long back in the 11th century when King Dharmapal of the Pala dynasty brought nearly 26 weaving families from the village Tapikusi to Swarkusi. Other than the women, the males are equally involved in this form of calf. Besides, the region of Swalkusi is a center for ancient holistic temples and satras or the community prayer halls. So friends, that was all about Swalkusi. The memories, the experiences, the love, the emotions that this place has triggered will stay somewhere deep inside me, making me move forever. <laughs>